What's up, YouTube? I'm King Shanks, and this is Droid's Finest. I am back with Fairy Elements Part 34. Let's get going to talk to this mayor about some stuff. Here's another 45 minutes of dialogue, probably. Visitors to this little village? Unusual. You're not from the Humilia tribe, are you? Heh. <laughs> they realized so quickly. You fled here in the face of Humilia attack, right? Yeah, that's right. Would you let us take a rest in this village? I already did. I slept in the last video. Biatch! Okay, anyways. Only for a short time is fine. Of course you can take a rest. You can stay forever if you want. There are so many soldiers living in this village who got tired of the war with Humilia tribe and left the army. Tired of war, eh? Anyway, I'll get some food prepared for you right away. I'll sort out a room for you in the inn, too. Just take things easy today. Sure. Thank you for your kindness. Ho 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 No, no, it's nothing. Alright. If you say so. People in this village are all so kind. I sort of feel more at home here than in Surge Village. A Humilia tribe... Wait, a Humilia... A Humilia village. It's a complex sort of a feeling. It's because they think we're from the Demonius tribe, I guess. Or maybe it's just the kind nature of the Demonius people who live in this village. So there are people from the Demonius tribe who are tired of war too. If we can all talk together and things go well, it might be possible to bring war to an end in a peaceful way. In that case, shall we show them who we really are? That's... Whoa, what's happening? Something happened. Oh! Oh! Oh, hi! Mentor, I wanted to see you again so much. Me too, Kabasa. Orca! One of the legendary material crystals you're looking for is, is, is at Imandola Ruins. Please, before the Demonius King finds it. Wait, wait, Orca. Sorry, Yamato. My mentor. How come Orca knows where the material crystals are? <clears throat> Don't ask me, but Orca's information is accurate. That much is has pr that much was proved at Surge Village. <clears throat> do you know where Amandola ruins are, Harlick? Of course I do. Great, so let's head to Amandola ruins right now. We need to get the remaining legendary crystals before the Demonius King does. Pop up, pop up, stop it. Okay. I'm so amped up to be getting my laptop too, like, I can't wait, it's gonna be great. So, you can obviously expect, very obviously, some of the very first things I'm gonna do is a bunch of horror, like, a ton of horror, and yeah, it's gonna be just awesome, I can't wait. Your Highness, unfortunately the mission to capture the, mater the material crystal was unsuccessful. Um, well, I fought to the bitter end, be but because of the misjudgments of General Mistora, it really broke my heart, and I will live in shame forever. But I had to come back to make a report to you, Your Highness, and now things have come to this. Excuse me, Your Highness. What, am I being ignored? <laughs> General Shinin. Yes, sire. One of the legendary uh, one of the legendary material crystals at Mandola ruins is at Mandola ruins. Use the material weapon we stole from the Humilia tribe and go get it. Uh oh. Haha. <laughs> yes, sire. Uh oh. They have they have a material weapon now too. Wait. If I beat this guy, do I get a second material weapon? Ooh, things are getting steamy in this game. Alright, Mukok, Mukok, Mukok! I'll give you a place on the first team. Once you get control over your troops, you will receive a new command. Until that time, you may leave. Haha, <laughs> thank you so much, sire. I, Mukok, will serve you even at the expense of my life. A great general at last. Pop up! Every time I see the pop-up, I'm just going to yell pop-up from now on. Pop-up! 
You look like you're leaving in a hurry. You should take things easy a little longer before you go. Thanks for all your help, Mayor. I'll never forget this village. Such an exaggeration. Please come and see us again anytime. No problem. Now, I do kind of want to get that armor, but at the same time, I think I'm more than okay to go without the new armor. Um, another thing I wanted to do, I wanted to see if there's anything I can forge. Forge? Uh, fortify. Weapons. Light and easy. Great sword. I don't think I need any of this. No. Definitely not. None of these are better than what I have, I don't think. Yeah, none of them are. Okay, fine then. Let's just go. Oh, hey. It's you, fish ice cream. Yamato, over here, over here. Oh, it's you, Shika. What's with the... Oh, I came here just to see you, and all I get is that unfriendly response. What did you come for today? You guys know of the Labyrinth of Time? No. The Labyrinth of Time? You know anything about it, Arlick? I heard rumors, but that's all. It's a dungeon where you can get precious resources and items. Yeah, correct. However, the Labyrinth of Time is full of enemies with strong power. The Labyrinth of Time is northwest of Volta Village. If you want to test your strength, it's a good opportunity. Ha ha ha. Hey, Ashika, who are you exactly? What's with the wistful-looking face? You're not thinking of something naughty, are you? You're such a bad boy. <laughs> okay, yeah. You're not going to avoid the question this time, Ashika. Who are you, really? And what are you up to? Hmm. I guess this might be a good time to tell you about myself. Who am I really, in fact? In fact. I'm the best cook in the whole world. And my specialty is seafood ice cream. I'm Ashika, the food crafter. The best seafood ice cream maker in the world. So you're really, a, so you're a really important person, Ashika. <clears throat> Wait, Subasa. Just think about this calamity. Oh no, just think about this cal calmly. I don't know why I said calamity. Calmly. How many people are there in the world who want to make seafood ice cream, do you think? Uh, yeah, you got a point there. Actually, you're not a food crafter. You're more like a food crusher. What you do is... Sa sa oh, what you do is sacrilege against food. That's all. I didn't read that. In fact, leaving the taste aside, putting fish on top of ice cream is not so bad. The coldness of the ice cream keeps the raw fish fresh, after all. Huh. I, I honestly didn't think about it like that. Ah, thanks. If you're going to praise my seafood ice cream that much, guess you must be something special. <coughs> yeah, instead of ha-ha, I would just cough-cough there. Anyways. Don't get the wrong idea, kid. I didn't say anything about the taste. Our really top class cooks don't just have knowledge of ingredients and nutrition, they need an artistic sense of the presentation, too. Huh. <laughs> I guess I'll still need more practice. Okay. See you again sometime. Mwahahaha. <laughs> okay. Bye. So in the end, she got out of answering this time, too. But the Labyrinth of Time, if we can get the precious resources and items there, I think we should be, we should go pay a visit. Okay, I guess, let's do that then. So I already have one key to open these, but I don't know which one to open, because I don't know if I'm ever going to get another chance to open another one, so. Huh, why does seafood ice cream taste so good? It really is a miracle food. That even the gods would be surprised at. Anyways, to the northwest of Volta Village, there is a place called the Time Labyrinth of Time. Labyrinth of Time is swarming with strong enemies, but you can get precious items and crystals. So if you have time, pay it a visit. I have time. I think I might do that right now. 
hopefully it just shows up on my map and I don't have to- Oh god, more dialogue. Ugh, dialogue. The Mandula ruins are deep in the mountains to the northeast. <clears throat> we need to get the legendary material crystal before it's stolen away by the Demonius King. I'll do my best to help too, Yamato. Purr. Yeah, Sibasa and Rick, I'm relying on you. Okay. So, hopefully... Okay, so the Labyrinth of Time doesn't show up. That's just showing me where to go to the Mandula Ruins. And also, this Labyrinth of Time might only be for if you buy the game, or it might be something that I have to purchase. So, I'll, I don't know. We'll figure it out. Anyways, where am I going? Wait, why am I going this way? Wait, didn't I come up from this side? I thought I came up... Yeah, I did come up from this side, didn't I? So then what the hell's over there? Well, we're gonna find out. If you're wondering why I haven't fought those guys, because I already did. I'll fight this guy. I haven't fought him yet. I'll fight them all, I guess, but... Uh-oh. I thought my weapon got stronger. How come I don't have anything that makes it seem any stronger? Sink punch. I thought... Is that all enemies? No, random. Okay, yes. Try that. Uh, wait. No. All enemies. I'm just gonna keep using stuff that attacks all enemies for these fights, because why wouldn't I? Makes it a lot easier on me. Yeah, and I thought, I thought my gun got something extra. I don't have anything, I don't have an extra crystal in it or anything. I don't have, I don't know. Maybe it just got stronger, I'm not sure. Pop up. Okay, so what the hell is down here? Oh yeah, just a dead end, eh? Yep, of course. Forgot how games love doing that. Yeah, I haven't played in a month, and I completely forgot that games have dead ends. Yep, that's how my life is, everybody. I'm basically a glorified goldfish. I guess it did get stronger. I'm not sure. I really couldn't tell you. I have no idea. I feel like I probably should have got that armor, but I'm just, I don't really care. I'll just heal. I'm good. And I have two characters that have cure-all, so I should be alright. Technically speaking, I should be okay. Oh, I'm gonna auto-attack you. Eh. Eh. Alrighty then. So they said to the northeast is the time labyrinth to the northwest no to the northeast is Emendula thingamajula Rubalu. uh yeah whatever so yeah to the nor northwest was the time labyrinth which I'm gonna go check out first and then to the north east is where I would actually continue the the game, basically. Where are you? Okay, fine. Fine! No, not that way. Oh, you wanna fight? I'll fight you. I'll fight you, you little punk. Bring it on. Eh. Actually, it's not gonna be much of a fight. I'm just gonna shoot you with my cannon. Told you that's how it was gonna go down. Pop up. Oh, that's gonna get so annoying. Now now it's popping up and I'm screaming pop up. That's gonna get super annoying really fast for everybody. Whoa. That should be an attack from behind. I did walk up to him from behind. Okay, fine. Call me a liar. 
None of them are very strong, so I'll just kill them. Auto attack style. Okay, so time labyrinth should be over here. There it is. You're looking like a you're looking looking like a little bit of a time labyrinth over there, buddy. Okay, so I'm just gonna hit a save quick. Pop up. Labyrinth of time. Yeah. Okay, I guess this is a fully playable dungeon. Haha, <laughs> so you came, Yamato. Is this the Labyrinth of Time, Ashika? Yeah, it is. In the Labyrinth of Time... Oh, and in the Labyrinth of Time, there are rare crystals, resources, and items just waiting to be found. For example, the time material crystal known from ancient generations. Ha ha ha. What? Is that true, Ashika? I'm not lying. It's different from the legendary material crystals you've been searching for, but it's really, it's a really precious thing. However, as I said before, here in the Labyrinth of Time, there are m more enemies prowling around as you go to the higher floors. Let your guard down, it'll be an instant death for you. Uh-oh, that's not good. That's not good, because I haven't died yet. How many floors are there in the Labyrinth of Time? There are 20 floors. Holy shit, man! There are 20 floors in all, Yamato. Just be careful along the way. There are are powerful enemies. If you get to the highest floor, you'll... Ah, uh, I'll tell you more if you get that far. Do your best, but try not to get killed. Ha 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 ha. Oh. Try not to get killed. Are we really gonna go into the Labyrinth of Time, Yamato? The difficulties are huge, but there are many things we might be able to gain. I think it's worth trying the Labyrinth of Time. Yeah, but... Ah, uh, okay. If you're going, Yamato, then of course I'll go with you. Mm -mm. In that case, let's get all the treasure. Her. Enthusiasm is good, but don't be blinded by ambition so much that you don't realize when it's a good time to quit. Sometimes you can be a little rash. Yeah, yeah, okay. Don't get so angry, Sabasa. He might try to pretend... It's not true. He, wait, he might try to pretend it's not so, but Harlick worries about you. <coughs> hey, is that right, Harlick? Huh. I just don't want to get caught up in your mistakes. You really can't show your feelings, can you? Okay, we'll pretend that that's the reason. Hey, there's no hidden meaning. It's the truth. Hee <laughs> hee. Oh, here we are, the Labyrinth of Time, apparently. Ugh. I got an achievement? How did I get an achievement? Ugh, okay, whatever. Fine, I'll take it. Divine Water of Life gained. Am I really trying this? I don't know if I can do this so early. I am I mean, it might help me, it will really help me level up, probably. But... The further I go on, the stronger they're going to get, right? Right. Well. Sure, I guess. Oh, so they're that strong already. Okay, fine. That little tiny thing almost killed me in one hit. The EXP is insane. If, if I can, if I can hang out in here for a bit, I could really level up. Okay, let's, I'm, I'm gonna just, yeah, I'll try the first floor, I guess. This is something that I'll probably come back to. I don't know if I can actually win here. I'm not sure just how strong everything in here is. Oh, they're strong. Ooh, they're strong. I might die here. That, that's stronger than the... 
than the last boss that I went up against. Yeah, that's insanely strong. Okay. See, normally I just want to do an auto, but I cannot do an auto attack in this. Oh god, they're really strong. Oh, that's not good. Oh, that's not good. Oh, they're strong as hell. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay. So, yep. Yeah. I don't know. I haven't seen a game over yet. I have not seen a game over in this game yet. So, you know what I'm going to do? I'm just going to go auto. I want to see the game over screen. It's fine. I know. I'm ruining my record of not dying. It sucks. But, whatever. Let's see the game over screen. Completely defeated. That's it? Complete restore with... No. No. I don't want to... No. No, I don't want to retry the battle. Return to the title. Oh, God. How far back is that going to bring me? I don't know how far back that's going to bring me. Oh, God. I'm going to just click continue and hopefully it continues me in that area, but not in the battle. Ah, it did. Good. Good, good, good. Okay, I'm leaving. So, I'll do the- I will do this. Don't get me wrong. This I will do. I'm going to write it down right now. And it should be marked on my map. I will do this. This is something I'm definitely going to do in the game. Okay, so... Labyrinth. Of time. Revisit. I'm going to revisit it when I feel I'm strong enough to actually win. Anyways, let me get out of here. Pop up. I I've already ran out of time, so i got to end this episode. But I want to at least get towards my next destination. So let's go over there. Yeah, I'll just squeak by, you know, just, nobody saw me. Oh, shit. Oh, God, no. I'm in a good mood today. The seafood ice cream is great. Ha, ha, ha. You certainly do seem in a really good mood, Ashika. Did something good happen? Yeah, actually. As I was walking along the path, I picked up some transmigration ore. Ah, yeah. Let me give you a piece. If you use transmig uh, trans tra transmigration ore, you can return a weapon you fortified to its maximum level to how it was before fortifying. Return it to how it was before fortifying. Doesn't that mean doesn't that mean you make it weaker? <laughs> Not quite, Yamato. The difference in attack strength between the weapon before and after transmigration is added. Don't worry. Also, the level of the main slot and the sub-slots increased by fortifying also go up. In other words, by repeating transmigration and fortifying, the attack strength increases greatly and the slot levels and numbers increase too. So you mean that we can make any weapon as strong as it can be, right? Right. You interested now? Look at this great transmigration ore. Go on, take it. Sure. I, I haven't done that yet, but sure. Haha, <laughs> see you again. That transmigration ore smells like smells of fish. I guess she must have spilt some of her ice cream on it. Anyway, if there's a weapon we are able to fortify, right, to the max, we should try using that transmigration ore. Sure. Why not? Okay, so that's blocked off. That'll probably open up later on. Let's see if I can auto-kill these guys. These guys are newer, stronger enemies. I don't think I've ever seen one of these wolf things before, so that's new. Hmm. 
Now, where the hell is the... Is that it? Is that my cave? That's my cave. Alright, so let me fight this guy. I'll save, and then I gotta get to the next episode. And then I'll start the new cave. Whoa! Hi! How are you, my friend? Jesus Christ, you're hideous. Wow, look at the detail in that. Nice. Sink punch. Twice. Oh my god, he's strong. Holy hell is he strong. Poison attack. Oh dear god, he's strong. Oh my god, he's strong. Oh, no. Surprisingly enough, his attacks aren't so great. At least, not so far. So far, it wasn't so great. Okay, now it's not too bad. Now he's not too shabby. Okay, cure all. <clears throat> and he'll also use cure all. I guess I'm going to be relying on poison attack and knockback on this. And probably my cannon, too, so... Okay, I'm just going to keep repeating the process, because honestly, this guy is pretty tough, and... I don't want to screw anything up here. Well, I guess... No, heavy punch. Wild gunman, back him up, bam. Okay, so th this guy's like the equivalent of one of the giant worms. For this area, anyways. Okay, so we're still good, but I'm okay. I'm gonna keep using her for cure all, and then I'll I'll keep doing my attack the way I'm doing it: heavy punch and poison attack and knockback or whatever. Wild gunman. And I should be able to take him down. Might take a while. Pretty fucking strong. I didn't need to do that. Okay. I don't need to use a cure-all this time. So I'm going to use her... For some cold water. Hundred yes, give that to Furball. Furball Rick. Okay, I think I got him. He's poisoned, he's hurting. The poison's really doing a ton of damage to him, so that's awesome. Poison damages him like you wouldn't believe. It really damages anybody. It's the poison itself does more damage than the actual attack does, so that's kind of cool. Mm. Okay, now you can use cure all. What do you think? Should I drop a cannon? Too late. I already did. Boom. I wonder how much GXP I'm gonna get for this. And gold. There's a big old dirty dragon. Whoa! Paid off. Jeez. Thank you. Pop up. Something tells me I should have picked up better items. And I'm going to, actually. I'm out of time. I gotta remember that. I'm out of time. Let me just go in here. I'm not gonna do any of the dialogue. I'm just going to go in so that it's marked on my map. I'm going to save. And I'm going to say goodbye. Anyways, that's it for this one. In the next episode, I'm going to attack this, but I'm going to buy a bunch of healing items so that I don't fuck up while I'm in there. Anyways, stay tuned and I'll see you soon. Peace!